now you can actually see, you know, the dark areas were pulled down. And in fact, I want to see the actual terrain. So one thing you can do is click the object, go to its properties, and then go to its material properties. And under material, there's a couple of things you can do, but I'm going to make a custom material over here. And in this custom material, I'm going to call this, uh, you know, Martian surface. Okay. And the way that you get an image on here is under textures. If you see this textures tab, just pull that down, go to color, check color. And here it's going to, again, open up the file browser. So remember, I have two files up here, blur and the original one, right? The blur I use for the height field, the image I want to use, the original. So go ahead, click the original, click open, and it should place the original image on top of the surface. And now you can actually see, you know, the dark areas were pulled down, the lighter areas are pulled up. You see this valley starts to emerge because this area is a lot darker. Right? This is a lot better, you know? Um, and in my rendered view now, this is what it looks like. And that's how you get a topographical map from an image by using height field.